Welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking and today what I'm going to show you is my homemade English muffins. So let's get started. Now I'll place two and a half cups of warm water in my bowl. I have two tablespoons of sugar that I'll place in this water. along with the one packet of rapid rise yeast. Now I'll cover my bowl and I'll let this rest for 10 minutes. Now I'll check on the water, the yeast, and the sugar. Oh yeah, that's perfect. So now I'll move my water, my yeast, and my sugar into this large mixing bowl. To this mixture, I have two teaspoons of salt that I'll add in, along with four tablespoons of melted butter, to this mixture I'll add in five and a half cups of flour. Now I'll blend this all together. What I'm going to do is put some flour on my counter, take the mixture out of the bowl, Now I'll knead the dough for about five minutes. Use enough flour so that it's, the dough isn't too sticky. You want to stop it from being sticky. I added enough flour to make the dough not so sticky. I have my bowl with oil in it. So now I'll take this dough place it in my oiled bowl. Cover it and let it rest till it doubles in size. Probably take about an hour. I place my dough under my heat lamp to help speed up the process, so I'll check it. Oh yeah, it doubled in size. So now I have two bacon trays. I'll place some parchment paper on top. Once I roll out my dough, then I'll place my dough balls on top of this parchment paper. So I'll place this off to the side. So now I'll uncover my dough. You can see how nice that rose. I'll place just a little bit of flour on my counter. Take the dough out of my bowl. I put flour on my hands. So just knead the dough a couple of times. You'll divide the dough into 20 equal balls. So what I'm going to do is take my dough cutter, try my best into making them all the same size. So roll the dough. 
on my parchment paper, I'm going to take a fourth of a cup of cornmeal. Just spray, sprinkle it on top. So now I'll take my dough balls. Each side, I flipped it over, so each side has the cornmeal on it. Now I'll continue on with my dough and make the rest of my dough balls. Once the dough ball is on here with the cornmeal, just take the top and flatten it a little bit. So this recipe should make about 20 English muffins. So now I have my dough ball. Put it in the cornmeal. Press it down. I have the rest of my cornmeal here. When I run out, I'll just keep placing on top of my parchment paper. Now I'm down to my last dough ball. It made about 15 English muffins. I guess it depends on how big you make the muffins. Place that one right there. And they should be about an inch high. So I'll let this rest for about 20 minutes. After the 20 minutes, that's when I'll place it in my frying pan. It's been 20 minutes. Okay, so now I'm going to take them, heat up my frying pan. Now I place some olive oil on my pan. I placed five of the English muffins in my pan. I'll brown it on one side and then flip it over. Okay, now I'm going to flip them over. They look good. I'll place a little more olive oil in my pan. Swirl it around. These are the last three English muffins. You can see how nice they rose. They almost look like they're store-bought. You can see how it's puffing up in the frying pan. So this cast iron frying pan really works good on making homemade English muffins.
look at how nice that looks right there. You can see how nice and tall. These are going to be some pretty good English muffins. So what I'm doing is just keep flipping it over, make sure they're nice and brown on both sides. See how nice and golden brown that is? I'll flip it one more time. Oh yeah, look at that. A few more minutes and then I'll place it on my baking dish and English muffins are done. Now I'll take this English muffin, I'll slice it to show you the inside. Look at how good that looks. I'll place it in my toaster. Mm, nice and hot. Look at how nice and toasty that looks. Now I'll butter my English muffin. Look at how good that looks. I'll give it a try. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm really good. These English muffins are perfect. <laughs>